hello guys welcome back to my channel so today i'll be showing you how to make porridge beans this is how i make my own dough so the first thing i do is i add water to my pot and um, when you're adding water please consider the quantity of beans you're making for some people they might not be able to measure it properly so this is a common trick just make sure that your water level is above your beans So I already picked my beans before now. I separated the bad ones from the stone and the stones from the beans and I washed my beans with water. So I'm bringing it in now. I'm just trying to mention this so you don't think I just bought the beans and I'm putting it directly on the pot. No, I already picked my beans. So guys, my name is Joy. Welcome to my channel. Um, if you're a new subscriber, thank you. If you're a visitor, thank you. Please hit the like button. Subscribe to this channel and you will not regret it. Thank you for being coming a part of our family. And to my returning subscribers, mwah, you know you are the MVP, right? I love you all. Thank you so much. And I apologize for my voice. I'm having cough. I'm having dried cough and it's affecting my voice. So I'm going to cover this for 30 minutes and I'm going to cook it for 30 minutes rather. I'm going to cook it for 30 minutes. While my beans is getting ready, I'll go ahead and start making preparation for my sauce. So I'm using onion, these three balls of onion. I'm going to blend them together. It all depends on how you want it. If you want it other than this, add more pepper. So it's 30 minutes later. What I normally do is this. I'm going to turn down the heat now. I'm going to turn it off completely. Add water to this beans and go drain it, drain it out. I like changing my water. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm going to wash my beans and... I'm going to start cooking all over again with fresh water. The reason why I do this is that it helps me um, not have at bone. It's quite good for that. You're not going to have at bone if you do this. So I'm just going to add water again remember the water trick that we talked about earlier and I'm going to bring in my beans now Just going to add a little bit more of water to this. I don't think this water will be enough. So this is the second round of cooking. When you're doing this, at this point, you don't need too much water. You don't need excess water because your piece is halfway cooked. And now I'm also going to be adding my chopped onion. So I'm going to cover this and cook it for 20 minutes. So while the base is getting ready, I'm going to start preparing my sauce. That's how I do it. I add palm oil to my dry pan. Then I bring in my blended onion and fresh pepper. I don't know, for some weird reason, my burner is just burning very slow today. It's been frustrating me. But I'm going to overcome it, of course. I'm going to do this. So it's taking longer than expected. I'm spending so much time doing one thing. It's not burning fast. So please just be patient with me. Thank you. 
If you noticed, I didn't allow my oil to bleach before I added my pepper and onion because I don't want bleached oil. I want palm oil. That taste of palm oil. So this is how you do it. I'll be making use of smoked fish, so I'm bringing it in now. I already deboned and washed my fish. I'm just going to bring it in now. And guys, please like my video. When you like my video, you just you help my channel grow. You help me become more visible and you help my video reach more persons, more people rather. Thank you. So I just added salt to these. I'm having cough and it's really affecting my voice. So I'm apologizing for my voice and my tone. I'm struggling to talk right now. So I'm going to be using one cube of seasoning for this. I'm not going to be using more than one because beans is sweet and this is just to spice it up. I don't really need it. You can actually do without it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn off the heat and I'm going to set this aside. I'm going to set it aside and go back to my beans and continue from where we stopped. So it's 20 minutes already. Let's see how our beans is doing. You see how slow this burner is burning. You see. Mm, this is soft, but not soft enough. So I will still have to cook this for long. Now I'm going to add salt, not so much salt, just a little sprinkle of salt to give the beans that nice taste because I'm still going to be cooking it. I'm going to cook for extra five minutes so it gets softer. The reason why I'm doing this is to make sure everything is cooking evenly. Sometimes you experience beans, some are soft and some are still very hard. It's not your fault really, it's, it's because the beans is bad. That's why it happens like that. So it's not your fault. Well, I'm still cooking, so I'm still going to cook this for, let me say, two, three minutes. Let me give it two, three minutes and I'll be back. It's looking better. You 
You know, sometimes just looking at food and you know it's ready. So because this is soft enough now, I'm going to bring in my sauce. Yes, I'm going to pour in the sauce now. I'm not going to stir this yet. I'm just spreading, I'm not stirring it yet. I'm going to add blended crayfish. So I'm going to cook this for two to three minutes. At this point I'll stir this and mix it up properly. So, I cook for five minutes more. I don't usually take so long. It's because my burner is messing up. Wow. I think I should just chill, cover it up again and leave it for some time. I'm not convinced. So I'm leaving it for another three minutes. Mm-hmm. This is what I was going for. You can see the oil is on top. That's a sign to show you that it is perfectly ready. That's how you know your meal is ready. When you're cooking and the oil comes up of your stew, your soup, whatever you're making, you just know it's ready. The case might be different with rice or jello rice, or, but that's how it works with soup, stew, and anything that has to do with liquid, with water. So my people, this is ready. Thank you for staying tuned. My name is Joy. Like I said before, please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for your support so far. Thank you for your love. Thank you for everything. Okay, guys, I saved my with plantain. Till we meet again. Bye.